There have been many crashes, some fatal, at the intersection of Highway 50 and Robinson Road in Knox County. News 10 Bureau Chief Nathan Springfield spoke to a driver who frequently travels through this area. He shares what they think needs to happen. Over the years, there have been many crashes at this intersection between Vincent's and Wheatland. Drivers I spoke with say it's time for a change. The intersection of Highway 50 and Robinson Road in Knox County has seen too many fatal crashes. Just last week, a 51-year-old Wheatland man was killed in a crash at this intersection. A Washington High School student was also killed here in May. So what is the cause of all these accidents at this intersection? Some say they think it is because of sunshine, which could be true as the highway travels east to west. Dustin Burris is a truck driver and one of many who passed through the Robinson Road intersection while driving down Highway 50. He believes most accidents in this area are caused by impatient drivers and distracted driving. I drive through here at least four or five times a week. Uh, and, you know, we see grain trucks uh, blowing the stop sign back here. We see cars not being attentive. and Whatever the cause, the increase in crashes has got the attention of NDOT. This is one that has been on our, our radar or is on our radar currently. Uh, I know we, we were looking into it as as recently as August. NDOT is currently coming up with a plan to improve the intersection and make it safer. Like many in the area, Burris agrees that something needs to happen very soon. Immediately there needs to be more patrols. Uh, I think uh, we have a, if, if you watch here, there's not a lot of um, state troopers, not a lot of police cars driving by. In the future, Burris thinks adding a reduced conflict intersection, also known as a J-turn, is the best solution. In the meantime, Burris says he hopes everyone will pay attention and use caution when driving through the intersection. I want to see me and my other guys go home and see their families. I want to see those people in their cars see their families too. The best way to see change is by speaking out. NDOT encourages anyone who travels through this intersection often to reach out with concerns. You can find that contact information on our website, WTHITV.com. Reporting in Vincennes, Nathan Springfield, News 10.